find the DNA in the nucleus. Right, so we're going to go through semi conservative replication of DNA. So the first thing that happens is DNA is unwound because it's wound up in a tight ball by DNA hexlase. So that goes, it moves along and it breaks these weak intermolecular bonds or intermolecular forces in between the nucleotides. So it opens it up into this fork shape. So now we've got fork shape. Once we've got that shape, then complementary base pairs will go and match up. <coughs> so our complementary base pairs are matching up. As complementary base pairs match up, DNA polymerase will go and move down and join up the individual base pairs by condensation reactions. And in a condensation reaction, one molecule of water has been removed each time, which joins the two nucleotides together until you have two complete copies of our DNA. Stop. Mm -hmm.